Hi everybody, Nurse Michelle here again. Today I'd like to talk about a zombie notes just for BCLS, BLS, CPR, uh, they're synonymous. Um, this is a terminology or vocabulary list if you're getting ready to take CPR. These are important terms for every healthcare provider, especially if you're getting ready to take a CPR class. And they're free for you to see on, on the internet. So some of the things that are on this list are, you know, basic um, terminology about anatomy, about where we're placing our hands, what's the abdomen, you know, babies or belly breathers. It talks about terms like that that maybe confuse us or we need clarification on. It tells us what airway support is, advanced airway support, um, what the AED stands for, so there's abbreviations on the list that clarify what they are, like the AED, you probably know, is the Automatic External Defibrillator. Things like DNR, Do Not Resuscitate, terms that we use in the hospital as well as uh, victims outside the hospital might have that ready to be seen, uh, especially for the EMS services. Um, there's important things like the Good Samaritan law on here. A lot of the terminology are definitions. It could be laws. It could be assessments of the, of the victim, whether they have cyanosis, whether it's circumoral or periorbital. These are terms that we use in the class, in the hospital, to define where a patient's or victim's cyanosis is. And cyanosis is probably on the list also. Um, which means that it is a bluish coloring. And it talks about different healthcare providers that provide this service. It talks about um, age groups, neonates, children, and adult. It talks about even jewels related to if the um, ACLS providers come and they defibrillate victims. It defines what sudden cardiac arrest is uh, versus a heart attack. Um, devices that we use in CPR is on the list, pocket mask. So it's a free list for you to review that goes over assessments, equipment, procedures during CPR, before and after when we begin to monitor the patient once they're in an ambulance or in the hospital. So I'm hoping that you visit my, uh, my blog, which is thenurseeducator.com. Please feel free to send me any questions that you have about any of the topics. And again, um, this is a free um, zombie notes about BLS and CPR terminology. So I hope you get a chance to take a look at it. At it. Thank you. Bye-bye.